Well, tonight, I think we've, we've said many times on here that you generally don't always do things the easy way. So it appeared, though, that the changes at halftime gave you quite a bit of momentum in that second half. But sum up the evening as a whole for you. Oh, I'm really, really happy. I'm really happy with the performance, with the spirit, with the mentality. Um, in a lot of moments with the football, of course, it was difficult for us in the first half. We, we had to make a lot of changes. And then in the end, um, you know, when I need Nico can play an offensive role, definitely. So, but um, then together with Connor um, in that situation that was then didn't work out that well. Even Connor is an incredible talent. I love the boy to bits. He's really, he will be uh, a Liverpool player in the future. But today, um, then in the combination, we had to make changes for the second half, Tyler, because of the yellow card. Um, and and Billy, yeah, just because Ibu was there. It was clear he can play 45 minutes, which I said to make sure. Um, and I actually wanted to make sure that he will not start because otherwise you let him play maybe a little bit longer, um, which was not right for today. So all the changes had, had reasons. Um, and first half, always when we played football, we were good. When we played the right football, we were good. When we played exactly in their formation, uh, then it was not that good. And then they won the balls easy and then they had their counter-attacks and scored the easy goals. Um, okay, the first two, but Madison was obviously... <laughs> we lost the ball before that as well um, in a, a not very comfortable moment. And um, then he could use his shooting skills. But in half time, we told the boys, actually, I told them exactly, I like the game, apart from the, the mistakes we made around the goals. And um, we have to improve, uh, um, do better in a few moments. We should not play in the formation. We have to use that formation to play around, to play next to the six, to play, to switch more often, to accelerate then, um, and to, to play in the half spaces more. So boys, obviously, yes, the changes helped, of course. When you can bring Diogo Jota in the, in the shape he is, um, is obviously very helpful. Um, million six um, was clear. We will now not struggle with mentality anymore. <laughs> we did struggle in the first half, but it was we, we guaranteed it for the second half as well. Um, and then Nabi, um, when he came on, obviously, if, ooh, what a game! <laughs> what a game he played. <laughs> um, so the boys were just outstanding. I, I really, I really liked it a lot. And in the end, um, Queef not only with the penalties but with the with the save against the Albrighton finish as well. He saved our life. And um, so, we're in the semis. Great. How big a moment is that in a young goalkeeper's <laughs> career to earn a place in a League Cup semi-final like that in a shootout at Anfield? Yeah, of course, it's important. Um, but... He is, he is an outstanding goalkeeper. I wouldn't, I don't want to say anymore he's a talent, but for goalies, maybe it's possible because they are talents a little bit longer because they can play longer. But um, he's now saying goalie um, with his feet, game understanding, um, all the goalie skills. Um, yeah, John and Jack over the years did uh, an incredible job with the boy. And it's just really outstanding. So, and of course, it's nice. It's um, now not the first time that he was part of these kind of spectacular games. Um, you think it against Arsenal it was similar, uh, but now he's even a step further. And um, yeah, how is that? Saved our life was really, really helpful tonight. I think I've got all the hands up I can take now, so we'll whip through these. Kaheem first, and then we'll go to uh, uh, Masatoshi. Hi, you again. What a oh, game for Taki. Go on, you go first, Masatoshi. I was going to come to you second. My, 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 my mistake. Go on, you go, you go now. All right. Can I? Yes. Sorry, okay. Fault. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Uh, what a game for Taki. You know, like he showed determination. What? What can I say? You know, that was uh, that was a great goal. Top goal. Top performance. Mm. So um, look, when you change that much, that's not that's not one hundred percent fair. When you then always expect on him and him and him, they have to um, they have to play the absolute A game. But he played a really good game today. A really good game, and he's. From a tactical point of view, he's outstanding. And it's so cool for him that he could score that goal. Eh? So it was a great goal. It was very important. It was in the best possible moment. Um, and was just... Um, he deserved it. He deserved this goal for all the things he did tonight and for all the things he did in the, in the last few months and years. And um, so I'm really happy for him. Thank you. Uh, Kahim? Hi, Jürgen. Hi. I just wanted to ask about Nico Williams. Obviously, he starts at right wing... And then he ends up a back at right back. What did you make of his, his first half performance in particular? Why should I make first and second half different? Yeah, I played a different position. Nico played a really good game. 
So how I said, it's um, we are used to um, on that side. We are used to Mo Salah. So that's how it is. It's the way we play and you know, how, how we can pass the balls and stuff like this. And um, how the, the passes we played there in that area, when we when we were calm and when we were connected and played short passes, then it was all fine. Um, but with the, these um, long balls or, or um, straight in his feet, it was too easy to defend for the, for the left back in that moment. We're not very thankful, these balls, let me say like this. Um, but um, actually, I expected when you saw our warming up, you could see when he cuts inside, his left foot is incredible. He can really finish with it. Um, so I was expecting one or two of these situations. They were good moments, but second half was, of course, better. Um, he can, so I think, always he plays from time to time wing back, he plays um, left side and all these kind of things, and he can play all these things. Um, but tonight we had to, to make a few decisions, and in the system, the right wing is maybe not his top, top position, um, but he can play it. And then on, on fullback, he played really well. Uh, he was um, involved in pretty much everything, was much calmer in, in, in the right situations, involved in a lot of... Um, um, combinations and so I like this game. Fantastic. Thank you. Last two then we'll go Simon Stowe from the BBC and Dave Maddock from the Daily Mirror to finish. Simon. Hi uh, um, Jürgen, congratulations Hi. on getting through. Um, the other day when the people were talking about the season, one of the things that w did happen was that FA Cup replays went. People spoke about the EFL Cup semi-final being one game rather than two. For the moment it still looks like two. Have you got an observation about that? Yeah, yeah, I think it would be better. It would one it would be one game, absolutely. But obviously, what I say is not too important. So if there are two games, we play two games. But it would be helpful if it's only one. True. Thank you. Thanks, Simon. And then final question, uh, Dave Maddock. Uh, yeah, and just to follow up on that, um, the, obviously you you've said that the, the player welfare is not being taken into account, and that this that would be a great. Um, a great way to to listen to what players and managers are saying so would you have a, a message to them to say think about the player welfare to to, to David, help David, the only thing i do with this with my messages is i create headlines i don't they never, they never arrived at the right places so we have tomorrow at four o'clock we have a meeting but it's with the premier league not with the efl i'm not sure if these people are involved or not um I didn't. I don't speak about player welfare, welfare since this year. I speak about it within six years, even yeah, or maybe even longer. So yeah, it's like it is. So if if the things I say would help more, I would say it much more often. But it doesn't help. It would just create now another headline. I said it. I, I would prefer only one semi final. So we we are the draw is. I think we play at Arsenal. Uh, I'm fine with that. We play there and um, see who is better. And and go for it, but um, I can I can't see any kind of changes actually.